Uh, okay, uh, now we'll see about the command task. It is uh, one of the important tasks. Okay, so before going to command task, so we already know that our source location is somewhere. We don't know where it is. Source location is somewhere. This is source server. So it is it is somewhere. We don't know where it is. Okay. So mostly these server it contains the or it's like Unix operating system. Unix operating system. Okay. So if you want to deal uh, this Unix operating system as a source. If you want to deal the Unix operating system as a source, <clears throat> client need to give the location or path. Okay, for example, uh, my file name is file1.csv. So we need to give the location or path. So this is the path. This is the path I'm having. Okay. So this is the path where my source file is exactly located in this server. Okay. So coming to the topic, <clears throat> uh, we completed the mapping and uh, we create the workflow and the workflow start from start, start button. And we have a workflow, right? So I'm taking this as a session. Session. Okay. So generally, we need to connect uh, from the start button to the session and we can run the workflow. But here I'm using the command task. So command task means I'm, I'm giving the command task in between the in between the session and start. Okay, it is it is a command command task. It is a command task. So I'm connecting like this. Start to command command task to the session. Okay. So why I'm using this command task? means so we need to know what is the purpose of command in informatica actually command task in informatica power center is used to execute the command line programs or scripts okay so the task allows you to run any command line program or script that is available on that is available on the system where the power center integration service runs. Okay. So here, so what is the uh, use of this command task means? So by using this command task, <clears throat> so we can we can do some data validation, data manipulation, and a data transfer. It's based on the requirement only. Okay, so for for example, for simply understanding purpose, what I'm going to take means, so if you want to uh, delete the duplicates, if you want to remove the duplicates, so what what and all we need to do means in in the informatica, so we can use the different types of transformation, like the uh, uh, we can use uh, aggregated transformation, and we, in that we can uh, give the group by all group by all the ports uh, or else we can use the sorter and we can use the expression uh, so expression for concatenating the column sorry so if you want to concatenate concatenate the column so you can use the expression and if you want to filter the request means you can use some filter transformation okay so when you use all these things means if you imported 
imported the file into your uh, Informatica, then only you can perform all these things. So if you want to remove the duplicate means you can use aggregator, sorter, and uh, different different methods. So if you want to concatenate all these things means you can use the expression transformation, you can achieve that. And if you want to filter the transformation means you can use the filter transformation and you can achieve that. Okay. So that is the process. But so what what I'm going to do means what is my my requirement means before coming to the source location, sorry, before I'm going to import the file into the informatica. So I need to delete the duplicates. I need to remove the duplicates. So for that purpose. I can use the command task here. Okay, that's why I'm using this com command task before the session. Okay. So in this command task, what and all I need to give means. So I need to give this path. This path as a command and also and also, so what I'm going to do means I want to unique, unique records. Why? Because my target is remove the duplicates. Okay. Unique. Unique. Find it. So this is the command. So we can use this command in the, we can use this command into the command task. So then you will achieve without duplicate records. Means it, it will eliminate the duplicates and it will give the unique records. Okay. Yeah, now we'll see how it's going to work. Yes. So this is my flow. For example, I'm taking this. This is the flow. So here I want to use the command task. So before starting the first section, I'm deleting the connection. And I'm taking the command task here. Here I'm taking the command task. Okay. Now I'm connecting from start to the command and command to the session. Okay. Next, double click on the command task. Go to the commands. So he, here we can give, we can give number of commands. If you want to, what it is, remove the duplicates, you can give the command like remove, remove duplicates. So if you want to, what it is, if you want to concatenate the columns, Means you can give like this concatenation of columns. Okay. So if you want to filter the commands, sorry, if you want to filter filter the records means filter, filtering. So likewise, you can give the names and you can write the command to appropriate that name. So if I want to remove the duplicates, so there is a path where uh, my source file is exactly located. Okay, I'm taking this one and I'm giving the command like unique minus u. Okay, so this is the command. So likewise, you can write a number of commands in the command task, okay? Go to clear uh, this command task. Actually, why we are using this command task means we can remove the duplicates in a file by using some, uh, some transformation. We can concatenate the columns in a file. So we can use some transformation and we can filter uh, some records using some filter transformation. But before going to this, 
before going to import the file into the informatica if you want to do all these things if you want to achieve all these things you can use the you can use the command task okay so this is command task so i'm not going i'm not going to run this flow because i'm not taking the source file exactly right so on this uh I'm just taking an example like a uh, file one CSV. We should we should use the file exactly what we are using for this mapping in this session mapping. Okay, so then only this uh, this flow will be succeed. Okay, so hope you clear all these things regarding command task. Thank you.